Hello, welcome to another video. If you're new here, welcome. Um, I'm doing my most requested video today and it is a furnished apartment tour. In case you didn't know, um, I rent a raised basement suite of a house and um, I have a super sweet girl upstairs. Her name's Erin. We're very good friends and I... I love my apartment and I obviously love having her right upstairs. So I'm gonna go ahead and get on into the video. In the entrance, um, you just walk down the stairs and I just have this little like area mat and then um, a coat rack so I just hang my coat, purses, you know the usual um so from over here you get this view so right over here is the laundry room it's literally a typical laundry room i have a hamper and a little ironing board um nibbles carrying cage and then i have a washer dryer i should have cleaned that up um just a little storage thing and i have a ladder vacuum mop all the things so it's just typical laundry room and then this is the view down the hall. So right here, this is just a little, you know, the heat hot water tank. And then I have like some skates and stuff stored in there. Random. I continue down the hall and here's the bathroom. So it is just a small little bathroom. Um, not much, but that's right. My toothbrush holder and my soap dispenser is from Walmart. I like this cute little idea of this basket right here. Just, I usually have a lot more rolled towels in there. But I want to get um, some shelves, some floating shelves for right there. What do you guys think? I don't know. I think I need to like utilize some space in here and also have a little bit more storage. So I think I'm going to get some shelves. Um, as far as storage, I really just have under there. And then here's the shower. I don't know. Typical shower with a little shower caddy thing. Leave the bathroom and here's the kitchen. So ignore this stuff. So my cousin, he's actually moving here in July and I've been doing like kind of some shopping for him. So I have some stuff stored right there and then again um, in my pantry. So if you turn over here, this is the overview of my little kitchen. All new appliances down here. This apartment was actually renovated, so I'm the first person to be in it since it was renovated. Over here, I just have, I don't know, typical sink, some dishes. I have these cute little things. I shared them on Instagram, and they're like a little olive oil holder and a vinegar holder, and they just like pour out. They're really useful. I have this little utensil thing. I think it's just from the dollar store, to be honest have this i picked it up from home sense really cute just to set your spoon on it while you're cooking those towels are from superstore i just like the colors i thought i kind of you know put some color into the kitchen and then over here my little coffee corner i just have my coffee pot um little coffee thing from home sense as well as the little sugar container so that's everything just a little cute um kitchen there's honestly a lot of cupboard space for the size so I won't really complain about that. I think the kitchen's really cute. And then over in this corner, I have kind of some plans for over here, but I guess I'll just like share that in vlogs, Um, you know, updating the apartment and all that stuff. But yeah, that stuff's all for my cousin. Then I have this big selfie mirror. This is where I take all my selfies. If you follow me on Instagram, you would know that. And I get lots of questions on it. It is from Ikea and I believe it was like $120 maybe. Anyway, it's huge. And I'm also five seven maybe five eight so it's really tall i have my purse there so then this is my pantry i didn't like clean this for you guys so sorry um but basically i just have all these bins so up here it's pretty much like medicine um what's up there oh q-tips i have some like crackers and stuff in there here i have like some cereal bins and extra cereal if you know me i love my cereal then i have a whole bin of oatmeal because i also love oatmeal um granola bars which i always keep an extra stash in the cupboard so i'm gonna have to refill those this is a candy bin i guess you call it with um welches basket full of ziplocs uh this is like contact solution you know some extra Kleenex, I don't know, random stuff. And then I just keep my towels there because I don't really have a linen closet, so I have to use this. And this stuff's for my cousin. I have like some boots right there. Just a little hanging rack. I'm not sure where this is from, but I have my winter coat. It needs to get dry cleaned and then put away. And then I just have like some Lulu bags and some, and some grocery bags to quickly take. So that's everything in my pantry. And then if you turn, well actually we'll start right here. So then this is like also connecting to that other little um, door that I showed you and I just keep some extra toilet paper. Don't worry I did not stock up on this because of corona. My mom bought this in September when I moved in She bought two big packs, so I still have one left. Same as the paper towel and then nibbles bedding and hay 
So I'll show you guys like an overview from your, if you're looking in the kitchen, this is like kind of what you see. So big entryway into the living room. Um, so this is on this side and then it's a pretty decent sized living room to be honest. It's actually really long and length. So this rug is actually from Costco. I have some little blankets there. I wanna get like a basket I think to put my blankets in. And then I have some pillows from Wayfair that are long overdue on the return so I don't know what I'm gonna do with those. This table is from iFurniture along with my couch. And actually I have to show you guys because these are so cute, but these little coasters are actually from HomeSense as well. This is my favorite scented candle. It's from Superstore. Smells really good. I have, whoa, I have an extra always on hand. It's the Bohemian Sunset. Love that candle. Anyway, so this table is from iFurniture. My couch is from iFurniture. This blanket is from HomeSense. I get questions on it a lot and everyone always compliments it when they come here. And then as far as pillows, so they're all from HomeSense. This one, it's really cute. I didn't really have a place to put it. I wish I would have bought two because it has like little sparkles and glitter. I don't know, it's really cute, but I only bought one so I keep it there. And then these ones are new, just bought them. Also from HomeSense. This is actually a pillow casing from Ikea, but the actual pillow inside is from HomeSense as well. And then these are from HomeSense. And then here's Miss Nibbles. Her cage stays right here. I'd like to do something um, right here on this wall. Please let me know if you guys have any recommendations of things for me to hang right there because it's the only reason things aren't hung up is because I can't decide exactly what I want. I also think maybe I should get something on that wall, but I don't know. Anyway, Nibble stays right here. She's so sweet. Cutest little pig. Anyway, her cage takes up a lot of room. And then this is my TV. My TV is just from Best Buy. I think it's a 60 inch if I'm correct. My TV stand itself is actually from Ikea. Fun fact, I built this all by myself. It took a few hours, but I'm so proud of myself for that. Like every time I look at it, I'm like, yes. I did that. Um, anyway, and then I just have this little Scentsy warmer thing, but it's actually from Walmart, and I buy my little Scentsy pots from Walmart too because they're a lot cheaper and they smell really great and they burn great as well. I have a foam roller. This is from Costco, I think. My mom bought it. It works very well. And then my bedroom. This room has probably gotten the most attention in my whole apartment as far as like decorating goes. So um, when you enter into the door, this is what you see. And if you turn over here, I have my bed. I hung those with Aaron the other night. If you guys watched my vlog, that's up a day in my life. I don't know. They're really growing on me. Those are from HomeSense as well. My bed frame is from Wayfair. I really like it. And I got it shipped here before I moved here. So we had it shipped to our friend's house and then I picked it up from her. This is a Kate Spade, bl Kate Spade blanket. Love this. I also have the gray one in the living room if you saw in the corner. My bedding is from Wayfair. I believe my mom bought it for me for Christmas, but I think it's from Wayfair. So these pillows came with it. These are from HomeSense. This is from HomeSense. And here's like a close up on the bed frame. It's really cute. And then my nightstand table is also from Ikea. Uh, nothing really too interesting over here. Just typical candle, books, iPad, all the goods. And then over here, I have always my little fan. And then on the back of my door, I just have hanging rack with um, some house coats. So this desk is from Ikea, but you actually just like buy these drawers separate. And then the top, I'm sure mostly everyone knows that. This mirror is from HomeSense. I have some little makeup palettes here. I have a little coaster because sometimes I like to just sit and be on my laptop and have like my iced coffee or something in the morning. Makeup brushes, uh, some perfumes, this little thing, this little mirror, I think it's from Costco. And yeah, so just a little dust setup. Then I have some stuff that needs a home that I can't find a home for. These clothes I just bought, so I need to go through those and put them away. This shelf is from Ikea. I just have my purses stored. So I want to put something right beside it. And I don't know if like a shoe shelf would be too much, like one of those like smaller ones from Ikea. This is how I store my purses. In my closet... I just have everything, it's really small, but yeah, I just have my jeans, um, bras, leggings, light jeans, light jeans, dark jeans, dark jeans, and 
clothes, um, lots of shoes that I don't really have the space to organize very well. Fun little thing about this apartment is it ha I have this little like storage room. The door is re really small, really narrow, but it's great for extra storage, especially since this is only a one bedroom apartment. So I just have this little cubicle and it stores um, some hoodies, some extra clothes. I have some extra clothes in the suitcase back there and I have another suitcase in the suitcase and there's clothes in that. If that makes sense and then I just have some winter sweaters in those garbage bags I'm gonna get Tupperware bins for them but for now that will do um, packages extra bedding um, a blow-up air mattress and some camera stuff it's all in there so once again that's a little overview of my room and then I'll just kind of like walk you back out this way into the whole apartment and then once again, we're back at the kitchen. So that's everything. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the little tour. I know a lot of people were just kind of curious on what my apartment looked like and um, you know, what my style is and all that. It's pretty bare on the walls at the moment, but I'm working on getting it all finished. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.